Oh, come on, dude. You can't keep turning into me. That's two four X's you're giving me there. Right then, welcome everyone to LMP3 Fix, and we are in a little bit of a championship battle. Uh, I have been trying to get some good races, and this is the technically the second to last race of the season, and we are 12 points away from our division leader. So we've got a real chance here because I think I've had quite poor results in the past, so we need to score better uh, 12 points, well, technically 13 points better than our previous results because it only counts the last eight weeks. So I need to finish as well as possible to get some good points and hopefully we might be able to win a championship, which I've never done. The highest I've finished in the championship is second. The person who won that series will know who he is, the little sausage. But yeah, we're hoping to finish well. Leader did a 30.3, which is alien, so we're not going to get there. I'm hoping I can be sensible, look after my tyres. It's LMP3 round into Lagos, so it can be quite tricky. Slow is fast round here, uh, and I'm very slow, which is not fast. So, fingers crossed, we have a good race. Right, concentration face. Give me a good squeeze there, Finley, but it's all good. They were like four wide in my mirror. That was a bit terrifying. defend that from the number nine. I didn't intentionally go for that move on uh, Finley up ahead. Just sort of happened. Thanks for the 4x. That was interesting. We'll have a look at that after the replay. I'm not here for safety. Don't care about safety. I need to get past him, really. I need to get past him. But Matt's giving him a slip through as well. I'm glad I haven't got any damage. Felt like a big hit. 
we've just done a 131.45. Sector 1 is 0.8 off the pace. Sector 2 is 0.35 off the pace. Sector 3 times quick. OK, Tony. Keep Adam under pressure. He'll make a mistake. Ah, good defender there, Finley. Going to lose a spot here, I think. New fastest lap for Kane. On your right. Hold your line. Hold your line. Hold your line. Play right. Oh, come on, dude. You Play can't right. keep turning into me. That's two four X's you're giving me there. I'm on the apex. You can't turn in if I'm there. Keep it nice and smooth. Come on, let the race come to us. 15 minutes left. That's 15 minutes. And that was lucky. Don't know if you saw that in my mirror. He's giving me two four X's. It's ridiculous. That's annoyed me. Right, concentrate your face back. We're okay. We're okay. Got a bit of breathing space now. Because he likes giving me four X's in that corner. And we still got no damage. That's a new fastest lap for Kane, 130.20. Gap to Finley, ahead is now 1.3. You've just done a Well, there's going to be a one accent. Free beat. The car in front of us is now Barrett, car number 11, and their rating is 2.5. Right, Matt's ahead. Sixth place. Your last lap time was at 131.09. Sector two is 0 0.42 off the pace. Maybe a cheeky little P5 here, but Matt's pretty good. He was quicker than us in qualifying.
A little bit hot into that corner. In front is now Big crash behind. There's a better exit. I'm going to have a little bit of slipstream from that. That's your best lap in this session. You're two tenths off the pace in sector one. Sector two is 0 0.6 off the pace. Sector three time is fast. Just too much speed into turn one. I mean, the leader's checked out, but we knew he would be. Fuel is fine, that's good to know. Oh, the slipstream won't be enough for this overtake. Oh, my lights turned off. Don't worry, I'll come back in a minute. There we go. Matt? You good? He did well. Well recovered. That's P5 for us. It's disappointing. I was trying to set Matt up for an overtake, and I too went deep into that corner. Uh, might be an off track. No, it isn't. Right, Joseph, what's he doing? Oh, I think he's a bit too quick for us. A 30.8 he just did last lap. Pay attention to track limits, please, Tony. We Oh, I got a 10x. Don't know where I got that from, but it's not a race until it's a 10x. It's official. The gap to P6 behind is now 1.9. That's a bad corner. Right, sensible head on. How many laps have got left? Like five? I don't know. I can't do maths. Some laps, that'll do. Great stuff. Keep it coming, mate. P5. Oh, our new best friend has just quit out. How lovely of him. So he gives us 9x and then quits. Well, he gave us 8x, technically. Not 9x. I had 9x. He gave us eight of them. Right, okay. Mario and Joseph, you two need to battle up there, please. That would be great fun. That's understeer.
Matt is actually closing up, it feels like. He's 1.3. That's a better exit. It's 1.2 now. Uh-oh. No, oh, ice forward. Ice forward. Ice forward. Don't worry about the mirror. Sector 1 is 0.43 off the pace. Sector 2 is 0.6 off the pace. We're a tenth off the pace in Sector 3. Yeah, it was four tenths quicker than me, that lap. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Roasting. No wonder it feels like my tyres are made of lemons. Yeah, he's much better in the infield than me. Fortunately, you can't pass there, so that's my advantage. Well, you can, but it's a bit awkward. Five minutes to go. Five minutes left. Stay focused. We're still in this. Right, them nerds up there are just leaving us. That's disappointing. I think my main battle is with Matt here. The car ahead is just <laughs> Need to be sensible. You've just done a 131.11. That's good consistency. Keep it up. That's a bit bumpy, but we'll live with it. As long as it stays at 1.4, I'm happy. That's half fuel. You've used half your fuel. Not sure that isn't an off track, but I will take it. Little bit of a wiggle out there, but it's not too bad. Ah, oh, it's not going to be a fast lap. Boo! That was a one thirty one point zero five. Right, you three, battle, please. Do me a favour. Oh, I don't know how that is. Is it an off-track? I'm really messing around with it there. About as layer as I get out there. I'm hoping for a good sort of maybe 110 points. I think that should do us. I think. I haven't actually checked. 
but I think maybe 110, maybe 105, 115, something like that would be good. That lap time was 130.76. That's your quickest lap. I'm glad I got into the 130s finally. It's taken me about three years, but still. I mean, I've got this. This is the longest race in history. Yes, battle you two. Yes. Ah. Oh. I didn't battle hard enough. It was a good exit there, but I lost a lot of uh, time on turn in. Doesn't matter though. As long as we're pulling away from Matt, I don't care. I like my P5. I want to stay here. White flag, last lap. That last lap was a 130.68. That's your fastest lap. It was a terrible corner. Come on, you lot, battle up there. I could do with some freebies. I mean, it, it's great for me. It's just really harsh on them. I wouldn't want their downfall, but if I benefit from it... That might be an off-track. No, still not an off-track. I am flirting with the off-tracks out there. It's ridiculous. Good, we're away. That should be us in P5. Oh, look at... Yeah, no, Kane. You doing a 29.9. Nerd. P5. And double the amount of Xs, thanks to that someone special. All right, Tony. Ten minutes of fuel remaining. Oh, breathe in. It's over. Good drive. Woo. Let's go have a look at what's-his-face. Right, so let's have a nosy at what happened here. So he's on the white line. I would still argue that there's still space there. I'm not turning in yet, and he's turning into me. So I would argue, hold on, I can do this. Look, I bet, I bet everyone can't do this. Are you ready for this? Are you absolutely Adam and Eve ready for this? Right? I think my distance from here to here stays the same. Right? But I think his distance from here to here changes, in my opinion. Yeah. So, yeah. I, I definitely think he's turned into me on that. And I haven't turned in yet. You know, I, I don't need to turn in yet. I want to turn in when I want to turn in. I want to get a better exit. So I, he's compromised me into turn one. I'm trying to get a better exit. He's turned into me. Um, so he's on his hot lap line because he's expecting me to be low and trying to go around the outside and that wasn't going to happen So ironically because of that contact we still get a little bit of apex Well, maybe I don't hit the apex completely, but again He can't turn into me and I can turn in whenever I want as long as there's a cars width on the outside Which there is we're all handy dandy. I blame that on him. So that's one out of two on him Let's go to the next one so again, here we are. So again, I'm leaving a nice amount of room for him to drive him to. I do turn in a little bit earlier than last time, but he still turns in more aggressively. And then, literally, I can't turn 
when he's on my bum. So because he's pushing my car that way, my car now cannot go around the corner because it has a, a, a lateral sort of thing of wanting to go that way now because my bum's being pushed to the yellow line, if that makes sense. So that's why it looks like, quote unquote, I lose control. But I haven't lost control. He's pushing my bum and he's basically pit maneuvering me. So again, it's it's this dude turning in too early. He's turning into me and you can't do that. You can't turn in when there's a car there. You just can't. He can flash all his lights all at once me, but again, that's two for two. <sighs> Deary me. Right, let's go see what unalive this dude. So looking back at it, uh, he gets to this point and completely and utterly disappears. You'll wait for it, wait for it. And he's gone. So my guess is, is, yeah, he got 17x. He got 17x. Four of those were on me. That was his fault. So yeah, that was fun. <laughs> right, let's have a look at Matt's whoopsie. I don't think we would have got past Matt had it not been for this little whoopsie. I think he was possibly maybe a little bit mirror watching for me. Break as late as he can. I was never going to go for this move because I'd rather set up a better exit. And he just, uh, yeah, just understeers wide. And he does well here. I think he, he did say in the chat he lifts off the pedals and just goes across the grass because if he tried to make the corner, he might spin. Definitely the right decision there. Definitely the right decision. And uh, he still got P6 out, which is a good haul of points for him. But yeah, I don't think I could have got past him without it. Right, one thing I do want to show you is how close were we to getting unalived here on turn four? I actually forgot about it. And uh, and what is it? Uh, yeah, there he goes. And th yeah, there he's gone. Uh, so... Looking back at it, it wasn't actually his fault. Um, here he is, poor little sausage. He actually reacts to the dude ahead. Probably breaks a little bit early, but the dude behind just plows into him without any notice. And yeah, I mean, he's miles away from me. I did see it in the mirror and I was terrified, but yeah, that could have been championship over. I'm glad I turned in, put it this way, because that could have been uh, end of race. Yeah, very close on that one. Right then, I'll put the results as they stand after I've just finished the race. Uh, where are they? Right, so here are the results of that race. We did get 127 points, which is more than I think, quote unquote, I needed. Um, so yeah, minus the 3.8 safety. I didn't care about safety. That's absolutely fine. So let's have a nosy at the actual championship. Get rid of those. I'm hoping that's going to be enough. We don't want to look at Division 1 because we know the person leading that, but we want to look at Division 2. Boom. A... Why can't I do maths? 21 point lead? I will take that. Fingers crossed. There's one more race to go. Fingers crossed. I will keep hold of this. I'll put a little message above my head to see if I did keep hold of it towards the end of the season, but there's one more race to do. I'm hoping I can keep hold of it. Absolutely fingers crossed, because that's the first championship I might ever win. Yeah. Thank you very much for watching. Have your fingers crossed, but by the time you watch this, you, you will already know the outcome anyway. So, pretend you had your fingers crossed last night for me. Thank you. And, uh, yeah, if you did like the video, don't forget to like and subscribe and do that lovely YouTube stuff. Otherwise, I'll catch you on the next one.